Hey guys, it's Kyle Bennett, HardOCP.com. Here to talk to you a little more about the Glacier Series from Fantex, the Glacier C399A. This is a uh, water block for uh, AMD's TR4 socket, which is of course thread ripper. And uh, we've got it plumbed into our uh, system now. And uh, one thing I did miss on, uh, on our unboxing video was somebody was asking me about how flat the surface is on this. And uh, the cold plate on this is really, really flat all the way across. It's not, it's not the best mirror finish. You see, once you can see things get a little out of focus once you get back from it a ways. But to say it, it's, it's pretty dang, dang good uh, surfacing, and it's, it's, it's nearly perfectly flat, which is what we want to see for Threadripper. But we're going to show you how to mount this because this one mounts a little bit differently than than uh, some of the other blocks we've had and I want to show you this and let's see let's get you in tight here uh, we're on our Asus Zenith Extreme motherboard using our Corsair RAM of course and we've got a AMD Threadripper 1950X down in the socket so for the purpose of this video I've laid this tape down I've uh, not laid any uh, thermal paste, any uh, thermal interface material down on this because I want to show you exactly how this works. And I just don't feel like wasting tin material because the stuff's expensive. So you get these four little standoffs, which obviously mount into our mounting holes back over here in either corner. And remember that these are offset a little bit and that these two posts are not the same distance as these two posts. So on the other blocks we've seen, you have to mount a particular way or make sure the well the the race storm you could flip the bracket around, but this one's this one's got a really interesting um, mounting kit on it. So these actual feet, and I hadn't used the hadn't used Fantex for these actual feet can slide around on the surface of that. So you can mount the block either way. I guess it might help you out during your install if you needed it, but I don't know. It's kind of kind of odd. I don't know. I assume this mounting bracket uh, they share with some others, some other uh, sockets as well is what it comes down to. They did send me, and I mentioned this in the uh, in the last video that they sent me an AMD TR4 mounting kit that obviously we don't need to mount on TR4. So I wonder if it just got the wrong sticker on it. And uh, what it looks like is an AMD um, AM4 mounting kit. So they thread it on tremendously easily. All these threads feel good. So that's it we're down so we'll get this off and we'll do some test fittings with some um, thermal paste on there and we'll pick back up there in a minute so we've uh, finished up all of our testing I want to give you a little beauty shot here of it down on the uh, Zenith extreme motherboard show you what it looks like with its frag harder lights turned on and so there it is in all of its glory uh, the more I used the uh, mounting system on here the more I got to dislike it um, some of these, I, I had these come off, had these, uh, the, the hold downs come out to the holes twice. You got to get a pair of pliers and take the clip off and put the C-clip back on. But the C-clip can actually slide through that slot fairly easily while you're, while you're uh, screwing the thing down. But temperature-wise, it, uh, it did great in testing. Even though this block is set up a little bit different, it's, it's bi-directional or non-directional, I guess. And that this can be the input or this can be the input. Doesn't matter which way it flows. The block is the same. It's symmetric in half. And there's no flow plate. So you just charge this one side and then it flows obviously down under, uh, down under, I guess, well, the flow plate, I guess you could consider that ridge down the middle of the block, the, uh, the flow plate. Because it, that is exactly what uh, forces the water down into the micro channels right there. But it did really good temperature-wise, and this is Kyle Bennett with Hard OCP.